to another bite-sized training tape for football officials. And in this edition, we'll have a look at uh, the rule concerning illegal forward pass. And for those of you who want to have a look at the rule book, we're talking about rule 732A that states a forward pass is illegal if it's thrown by a teammate player whose entire body is beyond the neutral zone when he releases the pass. So we'll have a look at this play and we'll note that the line of scrimmage is at, at minus one towards or in relation to the to the full yard line. You'll see the, the wing up here is, is one yard off the full yard line. So let's have a look and see what the quarterback does. And I can tell you he's going to roll out this way and he's going to throw the ball fairly close to where the, where the line of scrimmage is. Now, if we freeze it right here, we'll notice that he is actually behind the line of scrimmage when he releases this ball. So this is, in fact, a legal play. So where he is back here, the line of scrimmage is up here. So for this to be illegal, he would have to be all the way up to the full yard line pretty much or maybe even beyond because the rule says the, the teammate player has to have his entire body uh, beyond so even if if we have just a foot back here uh, on the line of scrimmage that would still be a legal pass so who is going to watch this who is going to be able to make that call um, as you'll note the line of scrimmage official stays on the line of scrimmage. So they are primary for this call. Um, if we had a situation where we were in the goal line mechanics, uh, the wings obviously would move to the goal line at the snap and we would ask our umpire here to move up to the line of scrimmage and be primary for calling this. In this situation, obviously he stays back because we've got the two wings uh, taking care of that. And that was it for this edition. So as always, thank you very much for watching.